Okay, so as we all know, World War Three is on its way. And I've been disarmed by the government, dude. Well, no, I bought a shotgun. They let me they let me actually buy it, but then I decided I had a better idea what to do with that gun. You know. I'm just saying. But now I need something really with some serious power, so I, I want to show you guys my this is what I'm this is the weapon of choice. For World War Three, now I'm not gonna have to. Di I don't need a real gun. God's gonna protect me. No worries about that. But there's gonna be so many dead bodies. You're gonna need one of these fly shooters. That's what this shoots salt at a fly. It's supposed to kill the fly. Just put salt in here. <laughs> it's a pretty good idea, actually. It's like a shotgun. So. Anyway, so get ready for World War III, because it's about to go down. And the last prophecy I got, I was all alone. And the Lord, uh, it was the same way I prophesied when I prophesied that uh, Russia, North Korea, Iran, and Turkey are planning. That was in March of 2015, I believe. I talked about how uh, they were already in Turkey. I mentioned Turkey, and everybody said, oh, Turkey's part of NATO. But um, in that video, and you can look it up, it's on YouTube. Yeah, and I was just um, realizing that it's really close now. World War III is way closer. And so when I spoke that prophecy in the church that uh, Russia, North Korea, Iran, and Turkey are planning to destroy America, and that was in, like they were in the act of planning the destruction of America. So this goes back, obviously, beyond 2015, what we're, we're going through here. But people came down on me and said, hey, that's, uh, um, NATO, NATO is a, uh, you know, I mean, I'm sorry, Turkey is a NATO ally. But it's, things have changed, haven't they? So it turns out I was right. Oh, Lord Jesus, help us. Then, when I spoke that prophecy, tears were coming down. I could feel the power of the Holy Spirit. Well, the last time I felt that same way was maybe about a week and a half ago. All of a sudden, the power of the Holy Spirit came on me. I started crying. And the Lord said, buy supplies, buy supplies, buy supplies. And so that, that anointing on me was the same power and the same manifestation my Tears were coming down the same way as when I prophesied back in March of 2015 that basically that Turkey would betray the NATO alliance. And that what we see, and then later, actually it was sometime after that that the Taijing bombing happened. And the Lord told me that China got on board. That's why China wasn't mentioned because in March of that year, China was not privy to be or or part of wanting to destroy America but it wasn't until after the Taijing bombing and everybody everybody in the intelligence all over the world knows what that was about that I mean I'm just saying that there's no second guessing what what happened in Taijing not being the CIA I mean it's pretty obvious if you look at all the footage of it I mean are we dangerous here I mean, how more obvious can you get to have people saying that? All American accents. All from a perfect vantage point to get the perfect video to show the, the immensity of that explosion with the, um, with the crane in the foreground. You can see this giant crane and you think... And then you see this explosion that's huge. I'm just saying, it gives it perspective. If it wasn't for that crane in the foreground, you would have no idea how big that explosion was. Anyway.